All right, BTP fans, we're here with Blue Table Painting Painter Ben. Hi. Oh, yeah. Yep. And uh, he paints good and looks good doing it. Oh, yeah. So um, talk about painting this bioluminescence on this piece. All right, right now um, I'm doing a level six. And um, I think really the bioluminescence um, really has to do with the color scheme because we okay. have a very cold and dark armor. Right. And then we're using a really... Um, what I'm doing is I'm we're, we're basing it with a uh, it's a dark sand first, okay, which is a very kind of hold on. It's a very uh, can you warm, point out what that is right here? Okay, got it. Yeah, dark sand. Okay, great. And it's a very it's a very warm off white color, okay. and then um, we work it up to a pale sand. Okay. And then when we what we do is we wash it with a um, what was that? Scurf scurvy, green. the scurve or scurvy green. Let's call it the scurve. Yeah. Now, if you buy this from Vallejo, and by the way, I high, this is a staple color. This one's a little banged up, uh, but um, the pigmentation in this tends to clot really bad, mm -hmm. and so you have to really you have to really shake it up extremely well uh, and often. Don't let it sit there for several days and just uh, become all. Right. Um, but I don't know, clotted? Yeah. Okay, go ahead. But when you wash that over the, the, the off-white, it creates right. a very warm kind of green um, tint, right. which creates Can I that. see the other side? Is the other side not painted at yeah. all? Oh, well, no, you've already done yeah. that one. Okay, great. So, yeah. And, so, and then it's just uh, some gentle dry brushing then to get the OSL yeah, on some, there? Um, you do a little dry brushing, and then if you want, you can do you know wet blending. It's a little sick, so I'll probably be doing both. But okay. All right. Yeah. Fantastic. Hey, thanks a lot, Ben. That was very informative.